erosion. Ero, eroi, eroi. <laughs> it is erosion. <laughs> Uh, let's see here. Uh, we got lots of crumbling platforms. So there's this is like an arrow mechanic, but it has like the whole crumbling platform thing too. That's a common theme. Um, I'm still just gonna classify this as arrow mechanic. That's the that is the the big thing. Okay, so that hits where? Okay, so the far left. I go over here, I'm screwed. Because what I want to do right now, what I just want to do, is go like this, and then go like this, and then go like this. But now, how? Because then what I want to do is grab my belongings and just walk backwards and it'll shoot it. And that, that's, that's the solution. But, problem, how do I get my belongings? So this is the puzzle that needs to be solved. I already figured out the solution. This is, right here, this is that whole, what I gotta solve so that I can actually solve it. This is right here. Got it already. Gotta figure out how to get my belongings. Okay. Ah. Oh wait. That won't work. If I stab my belongings, obviously I need to bring this with me, but if I stab my belongings, I can't but then I can't um, put it back into the arrow. And it's too, I can't traverse this. Wow. Wow. The arrow thing's the only thing that works though. It's the only thing that Then how do you stick it back into the thing? Okay, are we talking about burning it again? We are. Gotta burn it. Haha! <laughs> That's cool. That's cool. Okay. Right. That's pretty damn cool. That's pretty damn cool. That's pretty damn cool. Oh, that's a good one. That's a really good one. Ooh, erosion. That's a good one. You know what? Know what? I think I get these really big reactions to solving these puzzles. And I think it's due in part because I don't actually think about the name long enough for a possible solution. I don't use, I don't actually try to get clues from the name first. I just... And so what, like, what happens is I'll solve the puzzle and then I'll look, after I've solved it, I'll look at them and be like, oh shit, that name's perfect. And so I get these really big, like, you know, dopamine hits. And then I look at them and I'm like, oh, that's so dope. If I use the name beforehand, that's like a clue. And so that reduces the dopamine hit because like, like for example, this one, if I really thought about erosion hardcore, then I'll be okay, so erosion, erode. Ah, erode. So that means like, well, what can possibly erode here? This. So I kind of solve it because of the clue. And then and then I solve it like, that's really cool. But because I didn't even think about that at all the entire time. And I just thought of, I just thought of the puzzle. I didn't have any preemptive, like it's almost like the dopamine hit is like say 10, like, eight out of ten but if i had any type of clue or hint then it would take it down to like seven or six so it's just interesting now that i pointed that out i kind of don't want to uh look at these as clues but now i, I wonder if, since i pointed out i'm wondering if i'm just going to automatically do it i'm going to try to keep this going i've just i've been doing this without even thinking about it but i'm going to from now on i'm still going to try to keep it going and then only use names as hints when i'm just like at my wits end and i'm about to rip my teeth out 